We're here in southern Israel, actually an hour south of Yerushalayim, right near the Dead Sea at a beautiful location called Kibbutz Kalia. So what's special about Kibbutz Kalia? There are 80 refugees living here. These are 19 families. Where are they from? Up north. I want to remind you that it isn't just the Gaza envelope that have been affected. Tens of thousands of people in northern Israel have been affected by daily barrages of missiles and rockets and suicide drones by the terrorist group Hezbollah, which operates in southern Lebanon. And so tens of thousands of Israelis have had to flee into different central points of the country. And here at Kibbutz Kalia are 80 people living here. And uh, Bridges for Peace, we have been able today to show an amazing form of love to these people. Many of these people have never had such an expression of love by Christians, but we get to do this. So we brought a team of 18 people today to Kibbutz Kalia. We gave them couches and refrigerators, freezers, kitchen supplies, cabinetry, all to bless these individuals who have been here for months and actually have no idea when they will be able to return home. One individual came in, she sat on the couch that we had just set up and started crying. Why? She said since October 7th, she had not sat on her own couch. People here have had to abandon their this safety places of, of communities and their own homes that they have grown up in. They have seen destruction, they have known death, and here Christians from around the world, like you, are able to pray and support. I appeal to you, pray for Israel, stand with Israel, be a voice, but also give so we can be your hands and feet in Israel and bless these people.